Hi guys, my name is Stephen Blake and welcome to my channel, my review channel, Rate by Blake. This is the channel that I use to rate everything that I like, to talk about something that I've seen on TV, to review a program, a meal, a product, a technology or anything like that. Um, on the other channels I do video blogging, so if you go to Stephen Blake Official, all one word, you will see my video blogging channel where I go around the world. I've been around the world. I take it wherever I go. If I'm doing something interesting, I video blog me findings. But today I want to talk about Slim and World. Now, Slim and World is a healthy eating plan which I've been on since July. And I have, I'm one of these people that's a diet. I saw I go up, I go down, I lose weight, I go skinny, I go fat, I go thin, I go fat, I go thin, I go fat, I go fat, I go fat, I go fat. So anyhow... I started Slimming World in July last year, 2014, and I've been on it now since July, and I've lost four stone and five pounds on Slimming World. So the diet in itself, sorry, I'm not going to call it a diet, the healthy eating plan itself proves that it works, and I enjoy Slimming World, it fits around my lifestyle. But today I want to talk about the new thing from Slim and World. It is a corporation partnership between Slim and World and Iceland, the frozen freezer company, to, and they have just brought out Slim and World frozen meals. Now, Slim and World frozen meals are just there to help you if you need that extra little help. So if you need to go to work, if you work shifts, if you work night shifts, if you work shifts that are funny and you haven't got time to cook, uh, batch cook or make big cooks and you need something quick, a Slim and World meal will help you do that. Now, at first, I was a negativity of Slim and World because I've lived most of my life on freezer meals and I know freezer meals normally make you fat. They normally got a lot of preservatives in and they normally got a lot of fats and sugars and things in them. However, Slim and World meals are supposed to have less preservatives, less um, things um, to... To, to, to make it better, to make the food just as fresh as all the free foods that's on Slim World um, than ordinary frozen foods. So, um, I've got an example here. This is one of them. There was different designs that came out. There was the Singapore noodles. There was the pizziola. There was the sweet potato curry. There was the salmon fafel, fatafel, fafel, salmon fafel. There was... Um, what else was the? There was the beef with the root veg and gravy, onion gravy, and they also brought out sin-free sausages, sin-free sausages and sin-free meatballs in bags. Now I couldn't get my hands on them because when I went down to Iceland, I don't know what happened, but people must have been queuing out the door because there was not anything hardly left. There was the frozen meal still. I couldn't get my hands on the sausages. I couldn't get my hands on the meatballs. And I couldn't get my hands on the Singapore noodles or the pizziola. But I'm going to do each review of a Slim and World meal individually on individual videos so I can talk about the texture, the taste, what I like, what I don't like. And yes, yeah, what a Slim and World frozen meal looks like. This is the chicken tikka masala review. Um, I've made the chicken tikka masala in the Slim and World in the past, um, they are exclusive to Iceland. I made it in the past, and to me, it didn't taste. My mine personally didn't taste as nice. However, I'm hoping that this one's going to taste nice. I haven't tasted it yet, so this is what the package is. It says "Love food, love Slim and World chicken tikka masala." It's free foods and the extra easy of Slim and World. Tender chunks of marinated chicken breast in a tang ta oh, in a tantalizing leek spicy onion and red pepper tikka sauce so this is what it looks like it says it's got two pepper so it's a little bit hot but not too much as you can see compared to a normal frozen food the packaging is very colorful very bright very fresh food and the pa it's actually a big portion size compared to normal freezer foods uh it it's quite a big portion size uh it's got the instructions on the side so this one takes, if you want to cook it in the oven, 45 minutes, 45 minutes, or the microwave, 12 minutes. Um, it's got, uh, blah, 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 blah. it tells you what's recyclable and what's not recyclable. It's got all the nutrition contents on the side. Now the nutrition content and all the ingredients. 
Um, and it's also got, this is what I like about it, on the back, it's actually got the chicken tikka masala recipe. Now, the recipe of all the Slim and Will carton frozen meals have all got the recipes on the back, so you can make this fresh if you wanted, in your own time if you wanted to do it. I normally make mine in slow cookers. I just think the whole packaging and the whole looking of it is really fresh and new and it just looks appetizing. I hope it tastes as appetizing as it does. So we'll open this package because I haven't actually looked inside of it yet. Oh, oh it's stuck. Hold on, I haven't actually looked inside of it yet. And this is what it looks like in the frozen inside. Now that is quite a big portion of me and it looks like there's lots of chicken in there. This currently says it serves one or two people However, on Slimming World, I could probably have this myself. Put it in the microwave for six minutes. You then stir and replace the film lid and cook for a further. See, this is the final product. There's the carton. And it looks quite similar. It does look similar, apart from the little green things on the front. It looks quite similar to what it says on the, on the front. Um, it's nothing different inside. I don't know how it tastes, but we shall find out now. I decided to put it with rice. And as you can see, the portions are really big. Um, which is fine on Slimming Wheel because you can have really big portions until you're full. Um, but I decided to use a rice and obviously it looks very full on this plate because it's used as a... Just to show you exactly what the, the portion size of the thingy with the rice around the outside. So let's see how it tastes. Let's see how it tastes. Have a bit of chicken. Have a bit of rice. Mmm. The flavours taste. It tastes so fresh like you've just made it yourself. Obviously it does have that tiny bit watery effect that you have when you do get a frozen meal. Which I think, but it tastes better than the one I made when I've made this recipe in the past. Or a similar Slim World recipe. It has, um, it does... The chicken's great, tender, very good. I can taste all the spices in my mouth. Um, one of the things that they wanted to do, I'm going to show you. The things that Slim and Will wanted people to be able to do is was, and apparently they've gone backwards and forwards, bound and forwards, the meals, to try and get them right. And one of them was, was to, the chicken. They wanted to be able to, to chop through the chicken with a fork. And if it didn't slide through quick enough, like this one, then it wasn't good, so it went back, it went forward, and as you can see, this chicken is really tender. Really, really tender, it's really delicious. Yes, that is Slim and World's Chicken Tikka Masala, exclusive to Iceland, and they are three pounds each. Now, three pounds, you're thinking, that's a lot for a frozen meal, but a frozen meal that gives you a healthy benefit, as in, as in, like, as in helps you with the free foods on those times that you, you need without cheating or without using your sins, I think it's well worth three pound and the portion size as well is very very bigger compared to a normal frozen meal so it's a thumbs up for me for the for the slim and wheel chicken tikka masala thank you for watching i am going to be doing individual uh reviews on the the frozen meals different flavor ones and anyway, whether i like them whether i don't so keep watching my channel please subscribe if you haven't Try and follow all my other channels because there's different things that go on. My vlogging channel, Stephen Blake Official, all one word. Um, my music channel, Stephen Blake Music. Me, this channel, and please subscribe. And I thank you for watching. Thanks, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.